All over the world, you're seeing rural communities, agricultural communities in trouble, family farmers going out of business in the United States, in Vermont, all over the world. Uh, you're seeing people moving to cities. You're seeing gaps, significant gaps in educational levels, uh, gaps in the utilization of technology. So I think what you're seeing in America, in rural America, where actually life expectancy is going down, going down, is a lot of people have been left behind. They're going, you know, the jobs they have don't pay them a living wage. They're worried that their kids uh, can't get an education, can't afford health care. Many of people in rural America are turning to drugs, uh, to alcohol, to suicide even. Uh, so I think you've got a whole lot of people who are falling behind and you have political leaders who have ignored that pain and that reality. Uh, the fact that people are working for low wages, they're spending half their income in housing, they don't have any health care, they don't have any educational opportunities. And a lot of people around this country, and this is why I think Trump won, is people look at the Democratic establishment and they're saying, hey, I'm here. Do you know that I'm making 10 bucks an hour and I can't make it? Do you know that I'm paying a whole lot for rent that I can't afford, that I can't afford childcare? Anybody worried about me? Anybody care about me? Anybody know that I exist? And I think for a lot of those folks, you know, Trump comes along, I don't think people like Trump, I don't think they believe him, but he was different.